do this in the Danish Museum in front of like 2,000 people. Wow. You know, and actually you can see that. You don't choke up? You just, uh, no, because, because even when you get nervous, because you're like, oh my, look at picture, you, you're looking at the people, but you're basically doing question and answers. Because anybody interviews me in the house, everybody asks me the same questions. What do you ask Mick Jagger now? You know, how many, same you know, what do you ask Michael Jackson? That doesn't even anyway. That's anyway. That's anyway. Anyway. transmission drop to the ground. So okay. It was the same thing. Let me keep going. We're doing good. How did you get access to the yards and actually get in The what? The yards? Yeah. Wow. Well, each yard was different. You either went through a gate or you went through a train station out the back window that would go into the yard or you just, uh, all, all yards were different. You know, you climbed the fence or you went underneath the fence, you went through the fence. You know, it's either one or the other. You either you got through that fence one way or another. Or you went on a train station, it was layups. Yeah, or to elaborate on the train yards, what a comet's saying, a lot of the fences that you would go to back in the early 70s look like the fence right next to you. Just an old fence like that with, with no barbed wire. Just the way the fence would be, and you would just flip over the top with a shopping bag of paint in your mouth. And no cameras. No cameras.